What a do, baby? I'm Aoi, he's Leo, and we're Heat Cloudy Lounge. Today we're going to be watching Tokyo Revengers Episode 6. So get some popcorn or whatever, like and subscribe, and let's get into it. Mikey! <laughs> Their brotherly relationship, <laughs> though. It kind of reminds me of, like, if Tamaki tried being a gang member and Mori. Oh, I see where you're coming from. Yeah. Draken, the good morals. <laughs> Draken is probably going to most likely make me cry. If he does, if he's not able to stop the inevitable... I will end up crying. By inevitable, you mean his death? Yeah. <laughs> Damn. How was our main character couldn't gonna protect him? No. He would be able to fight instead of just like attempt to fight. If we trade our main protagonist, couldn't for Draken, I'll take it. <laughs> it's a good trade. It's a good trade. It is. But I'm glad that they're focusing mostly on those two as well. Hey, here's the third guy. Oh. Another commander. The gang. Oh, yeah. He's like the more like kind of straight up one. But like, yeah, but very he can calm. also talk crazy. <laughs> Remember when he was talking to Pa and then he was shouting at him, going, You're stupid. <laughs> right. The warehouse. Huh? Zoom in. <laughs> he can see him. You stupid bitch. You're not sneaky. The crazy thing is, we haven't seen him redo, you know? You know what I mean? He like, did. Zero style? He didn't get a chance to redo yet. He, um, he did do, um, he did change one thing. Um. No, 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 I mean, like, redo a scenario. Like, he got transported back, he fails, and then he has to redo it. He hasn't been able to do that. Yeah, because I don't think he can do that. I think it's one of... one shot. Yeah, he gets one shot in... If he's away from the actual situation for a long time, so if he's back into the, um... I'm getting distracted. But yeah, the days have to line up perfectly. <laughs> I mean... I'm proud of you. you. You were almost looking like Caillou. I guess the milk ended up helping you with the mohawk. Please don't tell me this is going to be a pony boy situation. I'm sorry, the name sounds similar. The origin sounds similar. Pause? What? <sighs> what is that? What? Did he just say, I grew up around the smells of pink condoms and lube? Pink towels. And the and lube. smell of Because lube. he was in a brothel. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I thought this was made clear. <laughs> it didn't register with me until now. Okay. This, this boy is in fifth grade. Oh, this is Draken! So his real name's Yes. What the? What the? What? <laughs> you're, you're okay. I'll, I'll let you register everything. That's... Sorry, <laughs> my brain. <laughs> How I had like brain cells during Megalobox, and I seem to lose them during Tokyo Revengers. Oh. I can't understand why he's in pain. <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
First off, how was he able to get a freaking head tattoo from, like, some bitch in fifth grade? Ooh. <laughs> he got a good right hook, too. What made him change? <laughs> yeah, that's my thing. Oh, I didn't realize that Mikey was older than Draken. <clears throat> you want to throw hands with a random kid that literally was told that he took down the leader of a gang. <laughs> he's older than you bitch okay <laughs> no i think he's actually remember younger. he's in fifth he's in seventh oh i think are you sure it's not the name of the school no seventh elementary it's pretty much middle school, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> hmm. So this this group is one that can even beat up Draken. So let's see how Mikey does. Yeah. What? Hmm. Oh! <laughs> wow. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> Just fucking jump kick. <laughs> he went straight for the leader and just drops kick him. <laughs> Told you. Again, I still think those are schools. <laughs> if, they're, if they're schools, then goddamn, they did not think of a name. And here, oh, he got it on his neck. neck. I didn't even notice that. I guess now. that's the Brandon for their. The gang that they made together. So that's why they both have that dragon tattoo.
So you just want to ask them? My brain's too mushy. I don't know who these characters are <laughs> that they're referring to. Mobius. Osanai. Mo Mobius is basically the gang that ended up getting Draken killed. So they want to talk to one of the members of them in the future. What the? Oh, That's Osanai? He turned to, to be exactly like... He turned out to be what exactly like the him? protagonist. Yeah, that is that the same Osanai? What the? Mm hmm. Damn, Poor what guy. happened? Poor guy, man. Oh. Okay, back off with the criminal, criminal, the blah, the fucking criminal investigation stuff, and let this man speak. Like he's going through it. Oh god, this is going to become some conspiracy stuff. I I I I need brain cells. The one under I need brain cells. The one under Mikey right now. The commander of Mikey right now. Oh. That specky asshole. Are you kidding me? The one that caused Sendo to die. Of course, has to be. Ugh, has to be. It has. To the one, the one that caused Sendo to commit suicide. It makes total sense. Yeah. Poor guy. This guy. <laughs> Oh, please finish the sentence, damn it. I don't even know what he was going to say. I, what, would have been part of the gang? I'm, I'm having the worst stink face I have ever had in a long time. I hate that. So it was an internal conflict between Tolman. Huh. Huh. So this is not as simple as we originally thought. Good luck, main protagonist, Ken. Zoom. I hey. love that the brother is just the trigger. Yeah. Like he's the only trigger. He oh my gosh. No, Sendo. Oh no. I, he brought it at the worst time. Oh, I feel bad. No. Dude. <sighs> If he starts, like, crying in that moment, I'm going to laugh. Honestly, I can understand why he kind of feels comforted by the past now. Like, he just saw this man jump in the future. Okay. 
Because if you don't get involved with the gang stuff, you won't kill yourself. Yeah. His friends probably thought he's he's bipolar as hell because imagine what he was like whenever he was, you know, back in the future and his previous stupid self right. is now in the past. So And then now he's like more mature talking. Yeah, and supportive he's like, and I support you. Do your dreams. Don't stay in this life. And probably as ourself is like, yeah, man. You wanna loot yeah. the convenience store and see some titties? Exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Damn, dude. How? You shouldn't be talking, you fucking slinky. It's like watching Timon and Pumbaa trying to be a part of a gang. I don't want to listen, y'all. Back to hell. <laughs> okay, we got to think about it through Pa's perspective. Pa is pissed. Yeah. Or Paul. Or pa, sorry, yeah. So he's going to try to send them up? <laughs> Why would Mike set himself up <laughs> for his best friend to die? <laughs> what? <laughs> mm. Oh, yeah, that's true. It's too genuine yeah. for him to like seem like a liar. Yeah. Way too genuine. Like, I get you're mad. Your friend and his girlfriend, like, got freaking brutalized by them, but take a second. Oh. Did he no, just make things like worse? Shinjuku. There's a guy with the glasses? I don't think so. Oh, shoot! It's Osanai! Oh! It's the guy that we just met! Damn, he changed. He changed a lot. It's like seeing the before and after photos. Yikes. Oh, man.
Are you slimy frick? Oh, nah. I was feeling bad for the guy, but seeing his younger self, he is such an ass. Yeah, dude. Absolute ass. Like, that's a whole ass army of guys. And one of him has anger issues and trauma, and the other ones are kind of like, what's happening? Our main protagonist is not going to fight anyone. Yeah. He Even keeps... Mikey and Draken together, I don't know if they can beat this. Yeah, I'm sorry, but we've seen this main protagonist can get beat up within five times out of six episodes. How are you going to reason with Osanai? Call him out in the future. <laughs> oh, and now we got to wait. Rough. Let's see at the end if there's anything extra. Let's see. Nothing yet. So we nope. just got to wait till the next episode. Yep. So we'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.